YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy again, back with another video. Now, new allegations are upon Republican lawmaker Dan Johnson out of Kentucky. Also, PBS talk show host Tavis Smiley is also accused with sexual allegations. And it's like, like I've been saying, man, these allegations are getting out of hand. You know, and, and you know, a lot of people are saying that the male, a lot of, uh, men in the entertainment industry are uh, being exposed and things like that but once again man we don't have no proof okay these women are just accusing these men with no proof no facts no evidence okay just word of mouth okay you know what i'm saying it's not right you know what i'm saying it's not fair you know what i'm talking about that someone's life can be destroyed over a lie or just word of mouth you know what i'm saying regardless of the uh sex genders you know but um dan johnson he's a republican lawmaker out of the state of kentucky he was elect he was elected back in 2013 and you know sexual allegations are upon him as well but mr johnson apparently a corner a corner out of our kentucky said that mr johnson committed suicide um back on i think it was tuesday night but i will leave the link in the description box you guys can read more on it but um, the details stated that uh, Mr. Johnson sexually assaulted a teenager back in 2013 after he was elected at a New Year's Eve party. Now, once again, do we do we believe all these sexual allegations, man? Like I say, me myself, I don't believe it. You know what I'm saying? Because, like I say, I go by proof and facts. I mean, these women are don't have no proof of facts at all. You just have word of mouth. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, it's crazy that once again, you can have someone's life destroyed. OK, and I'm going to tell you what's going to happen. What's going to happen is, you know, I could be wrong. OK, I could be wrong for saying this, but I what I think is going to happen is men are going to get tired of this. OK, you know, we already tired of women lying on us and, you know, what I'm saying making us look bad. Women have. I always try to make us look bad since the 60s and the 70s all the way to 2017 you know what I'm saying which they started this first you know what I'm saying but it's like they are never held accountable for their actions once again what I think is going to happen I think that men are going to start um pointing the finger at women and men are going to start um claiming sexual allegations toward women now you know what I'm saying that's what that's that is what I think is going to happen. Men are going to um, hold these women accountable. They're going to, you know, expose these women for who they are. You know what I'm saying? Because because a lot of these sexual allegations, we know that they are not true. Okay. But for me, I say if some of the allegations are true, then people need to be held accountable. You know what I'm saying? These people need to be disciplined for what they did. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know. If the allegations aren't true, then you should hold these women accountable. Or hold, hold them accountable for lying. Hold them accountable for perjury. Hold them accountable for destroying a man's life. Why, are, why aren't these women, you know, it's like they are walking away freely and nothing is being done about it. Nothing. You know, even though the majority of them are lying, it's like they are still glorified in praise. You know what I'm saying? Like, like I said, I don't care what color race women are. If a woman, she can be Chinese, black, white, whoever. If she lies on a man and you find out that she's lying and you know these allegations aren't true at all, she needs to be she needs to be punished. You know what I'm saying? Right is right and wrong is wrong. That is the truth. Seriously, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, um, like I said, man, a lot of people's lives are being destroyed. You know what I'm talking about? So, you know, but Mr. Dan Johnson, he committed suicide. Um, once again, Mr. Dan Johnson, he's a Republican lawmaker out of the state of Kentucky. And, um, you know, he left a note as well about the sexual allegations. He stated in the note that the allegations are untrue. And however, those allegations destroyed his life, you know, uh, which he wrote in his note before he committed the suicide attempt um what you guys think man if you like the video leave me a comment your feedback share the video if you like have more content coming your way 
Once again, my name is Joseph A. I will keep you guys informed. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel. More content coming your way. Until then, guys, peace.